Hello everyone and welcome to the weekly stream of Surviving the Aftermath. As every week, I am Davide, the community developer for the game. And together with me, I have my friend, Jimmy. And we have a special guest with us today. You already know him, Matti from Tampere. Hi Matti, how is it going over there? Hello, just fine. Looking so forward to this. The next update is coming this Thursday. And so let's start digging in into the first point that we have for today, the changes to the world map. So uh, what we did was add more mountains, as, as you can see here, mm -hmm. and even some scary mountains or Ooh. volcanoes, as someone might call them. And you can also see some roads from, from the previous civilizations uh, here and there uh, in different biomes uh, are uh, urban sector is now much more urban you can see lots of lots of uh, bigger bigger houses as well and some some details with outposts uh, we wanted to address running around uh, the world map going back and forth to the to the colony to drop off uh, different uh, items so now we have a tech for it in the exploration section called frontier outposts and these allow you to build the outpost depot. Now I have a new depot here. Mm -hmm. I'll establish a outpost. Now when you move your specialist here, he automatically drops the stuff. And it's uh, at the moment instantly transported here okay. back to town. Uh, and this works just as any other uh, stockpile. And then another change that I know is also a bunch of new specialists that are coming to the game yep. together with this update. They are right here surrounding, and I think we're also covering a bunch of them. So here, more special, plenty of specialists. <laughs> specialists for everyone. Yeah, plenty of specialists for you to get killed. Yeah, for but any yeah. new viewers, if you've seen Davide play during our weekly streams, then yeah. Anytime yeah. I look away, the specialist yes. takes damage <laughs> or dies. Yeah. Matti, can you go on the warm up and show yes. the other big change you made? If you are too far away from your uh, colony and you move your uh, specialists here and keep it there, go back to the world map. The specialist, once they have their uh, full movement back, mm -hmm. uh, they'll automatically move uh, towards where you told them to go. Let's go uh, to the next point mm -hmm. of this update, which are the societies. Societies have appeared on the map. Mm -hmm. uh, you find them and sort of start your uh, relations with them by discovering uh, the sector they are in. Once uh, you've discovered uh, mm -hmm. a society, you can build the trade center. Okay, nice. So here you can see you've encountered two societies, Little Anvil and, and Greentown. Uh, you have one possible active trade route and uh, new deals will come in a bit over one day. And how do I know like what they want in exchange? Like, is it on one one way only, or like do they expect uh, something else at, from at me? At the moment, it's one way only, but that's gonna change real quick. And then I think we come down to the last feature for this update. Yeah, graphs are here. Nice. So uh, there we now, go. You can follow uh, your resource consumption and production a bit easier in mm -hmm. this graphical way. So this is just to help players uh, keep track of everything uh, and plan ahead. We heard that many of you had questions um, and wanted to like questions about how we see the game developing. Uh, we are looking into ways to share our vision. But in the meanwhile, we have a small thing we would like to share with you. Here, you can see um, what updates we have planned at the moment for the future. Yes, things are subject to change. Game development is a complicated process, but this is an overview of the areas where we would like to work and in a way that is clear. Like here, you can see, oh, probably it's covered by me right now, but here in the bottom part somewhere here, there should be something that says subject to change. So I think it's like here behind us. It's here. Yeah. It's there. It's here uh, above us. 
if somebody is asking, hey, where can I get a clear version of this? Yeah. Like, uh, it's going to be on our social channels. Okay. Okay. I think that um, this is it for today from Stockholm. Yeah. And Tampere for today. That is everything. <laughs>